Seeing people share misinformation online is super annoying. But disinformation and conspiracy theories can be straight up scary. And as we've seen with the coronavirus, false claims being spread online now come with real life or death consequences. We live our lives on social media. So it's on us to be better at combating the spread of misinformation online. So if you're curious about how to vet information, or want to learn more about fact-checking in general, well, you came to the right place. Welcome to Is This Legit? A new series where a team of MediaWise teen fact-checkers debunk viral claims being shared on YouTube. We'll post weekly fact-checks, breaking down some of the most viral videos taking over your feed. And we'll cover a little bit of everything. Politics, pop culture, coronavirus to conspiracy theories, but mainly, we want to tackle stories that are important to us, things we care about, all while teaching you some digital media literacy skills along the way. The OIS Teen Fact Checking Network is spread across the United States, with some of us on camera and some of us behind the scenes working to thoroughly research and flag potential misinformation. But good fact checking always starts with looking at who is sharing the information. So who are we exactly? MediaWise is a nonprofit, nonpartisan digital media literacy project led by Poitner Institute. The MediaWise mission is to empower people of all ages to be more critical consumers of digital information. MediaWise is also a verified signatory of the International Fact Checking Network. That's a big deal. We're currently the only organization in the IFCN that primarily publishes fact checks by teenagers. Now that you know who we are, let's answer some frequently asked questions. How do we choose what to fact check? Our top priority is fact checking videos with big impact. So the videos that have gone super viral. As for viral political stories, now would also be a good time to remind you that, again, we are a nonpartisan project. We work super hard to be fair and balanced in our reporting. That being said, sometimes the ratio of fact checks from the left versus the right isn't always going to be 50-50. So before you come for us in the comments, we're asking you now to please alert us to anything you want us to look into. If you think our balance is off, please direct us to content that you think is worthy of a fact check. Next. Let's talk about our rating system. Every fact check will be given a rating, from legit, meaning the claim is totally true, to not legit, meaning the claim is completely bogus. Our other ratings include mostly legit and mostly not legit. Mostly legit is for claims that are mostly true, but with a small element that is false. Mostly not legit is for claims that are mostly false, but with a small element that is true. We also have mixed bag for claims that are 50-50 and needs context for claims that simplify an issue and could benefit from more information. On top of all of the hard work done by our MediaWise team, fact checkers. Every story, script, and video is also vetted by professional fact checkers and editors at the Pointer Institute. If you want to learn more about our vetting process or our editorial standards, you can find that information linked below in the description. But speaking of our editorial standards, this series was made possible thanks to a fact checking development grant from the International Fact Checking Network. The grant was supported by YouTube as part of the Google News Initiative, but YouTube does not influence the editorial content of this series. But if you want to learn more about how the Pointer Institute remains independent from its funders, you can find that information, again, linked below in the description. So if all that sounds interesting, subscribe to our channel now so you don't miss any of our fact checks. Because when facts prevail, democracy wins. And we believe everyone should be able to make decisions based on facts, not fiction.